But we begin at 5 with bullets flying outside a local shopping mall. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Natasha Brown. Police say an argument inside the Springfield Mall spilled out into the parking lot. Reporter Shante Lands is live at the mall right now with more on this incident. Also, the search for suspects. Shante. Well, Natasha and Yuki, police are searching for up to six suspects. They're also searching through surveillance video to hopefully make an arrest. It's business as usual at the Springfield Mall, but two days earlier, panic and chaos from a shootout in the parking lot. Everybody was pretty shooken up. Um, it's, I mean, I feel like it's just like a small town mall that we all feel comfortable going to, so it's pretty scary. What started as an argument inside between two small groups spilled into the parking lot. Springfield police say that's when a person from each side pulled out a gun and started shooting. Four vehicles were hit with uh, uh, stray bullets. Uh, but no people, thank God for that. Chief Joseph Daly says at least one suspect is in his early 30s. Police are searching for up to six suspects total. So far, no arrests. We are running down a couple suspects. We have a few names. We're running that all down. His investigators, along with the detectives from the Delaware County District Attorney's Office, are looking through surveillance captured from cameras from both outside and inside the mall. There was a community Halloween event happening during the shooting. There was kids in costume. They were giving out candy. I don't know. It's just, it's, it's very sad. The mall shut down Saturday and reopened yesterday. Many shoppers, like Jackie Panko, are still uneasy. I had a sister that was shot and killed. So, uh, you no, know, I really feel for these people. Daughter that comes to the mall occasionally, and son uses transportation all the time, so it's always a concern. So many people could have been hurt. A lot of people actually come here to work, to shop. It's just ridiculous, yeah. honestly. As for the shooters. Be in their best interest to come forward because we will find them and we will arrest them. And a, Dodge, and a Dodge caravan was also impounded that was involved in that shooting. We also want to mention that this is the same mall where a woman with a mental illness shot and killed three people and wounded seven others. That was back in 1985. Live in Springfield in Delaware County, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Yuki Natasha. Shante, thank you.